Steve, um, obviously not happy with the result, but the performance? Oh, yeah, very happy with the performance. Exactly, that's what I said to the boys. It, disappointing outcome. Um, you know, the, the game was really hard. It started at 1,000 miles per hour. They came out really pressing us and putting us under pressure, and it was very difficult at the start. But it was interesting to watch how the game changed through the first half. And I was, rather than being a coach on the sideline that yells like a, a lunatic, I'm just standing back and watching the boys slowly get a grip of the game which they did, and I think they started to control it 15 minutes towards the end of the first half, and then the second half we probably had the better of it. I mean, they fatigued greatly. Uh, they couldn't keep that pace going. So, yeah, look, result disappointing, but it's second round, mm -hmm. and it's a long season. Did they, did Bayside surprise you? No, not at all. Okay. Not at all. It's what I expected. I, I, it's hard to try and get the message across to the players to tell them what is coming and what to expect when I, I know it and maybe they can't quite get their head around it. But no, they didn't surprise me at all. Did, it, did the game come down to one or two missed chances from Ace? Was that the key here? Or? Yeah, look, I mean, they, they had the better of the chances, I've got to be fair. I, you know, they had more chances than us. But we had a chance before their first goal. Uh, things could have been different. Sometimes it comes down to can you take your chances? You don't get too many, but if you can take them, it changes everything. So, yeah, it, it may have been that, but happy with the, the effort and the commitment uh, and the way the boys worked. You know, we went down to 10 men for like 30 minutes and then it looked like we had 11. So, not, not, not that disappointed. So we've moved on already? Absolutely.